Next into the tank is a new product inspired by an old technology. My name is Jake Slavnik, I'm from San Diego, California. And my name's Eric Goodchild, and I'm from Phoenix, Arizona. And we're seeking $500,000 for 7% of our company. Whoa, In today's wow. world, everything needs to be wirelessly charged. Your phone, your watch, your headphones, everything. And so an innovative technology was released to make the whole process easier. Something you've probably heard of, wireless charging. And the consensus? Uh, if your phone's just slightly off the center, the thing doesn't even work. Well, that doesn't seem so innovative. It's not, so we've created the future of wireless charging. Whoa, whoa, whoa! 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 So cool. <laughs> Introducing ERA, the world's first free position wireless charger. This is the real future of wireless charging. Based on technology invented by Nikola Tesla over 100 years ago, ERA technology wirelessly charges your phone and many other devices. And let's get one thing straight. This is not a charging pad. This is a charging surface. That means you can place multiple devices in any orientation and they'll all receive power. Let me show you what I mean. One phone down, charging. Another phone down, charging. Put a phone in the middle, also charging. All three phones are charging with free position. This is the first of its kind. Put ERA anywhere you put your phone and never run out of power again. Wire free is the way to be. Isn't it time we cut the cord? So who's ready for the next ERA in wireless charging? Wow, so do we get samples? We have one sample to show you guys. Eric will hand that out. Are you shipping product or are you just, is it still in um, prototype mode? So we just finished our production prototype and we're actually moving into the production phase. So we have one, he's gonna pass it down. And I, what I want to make clear is there's a cosmetic example and then the electronics example. Which is the? The cosmetic example is the one that looks like a retail product. Is this what the finished product would look like? So, Kevin, pay attention to this one. We're actually a licensing business, right? So the electronics module that you hold in your hand is what we actually will sell to our licensees. So anybody can then buy this technology from you and they're going to brand it however they want to. Exactly, so Correct. the product in your hand now is how you might see it on a can retail shelf. Can it scale shelf. larger? We can make this in any size. Like what so, about an iPad and two phones, right? So if an iPad was wirelessly enabled to charge. It's coming though. Yeah, absolutely. Jake, isn't this available today? Tell me the difference between this and my Apple charger. Perfect, so wireless charging right now all works exactly the same. There's a little coil in there actually that looks just like this. There's a little hotspot in the center of that thing. And if you're not lined up, you can't receive power. And just to give you a little uh, insight, so Eric is one of the foremost experts in the world on Tesla coils. And wow. the same underlying really? technology. Yeah, he actually holds a Guinness Book of World Record for most powerful, one of the largest, most powerful Tesla coils ever built. Really? He's been an expert in this thing yeah. for over a decade. The wireless power, you know, between this big coil and the small coil is the same technology that's built into phones today. And Eric, did you actually build this? Yeah, I built this coil in high school. It's being rebuilt oh like five or six times. You, you actually <laughs> built this? Yeah, it's hand built. Are you familiar with U-Beam? and what Energis is doing as well. The I'm two not familiar with UBeam. Okay, they're two competitors. UBeam's company I happen to be an investor in that doesn't take the same approach. It's fully wireless from any point in the room to be able to distribute using sound-based technology. Hmm, interesting. I still think that there's a strong chance you guys get leapfrogged, so for those reasons, I'm out. Okay. Jake, do you have a final product? Do you have any licensing deals? Do you have any sales? So we already have our first licensing partner. They're one of the largest companies in the space. They put in their first order last week for 33,000 pieces. 33,000 pieces? And what, what is that retail equivalent? So it's up to our licensees what it retails for, but we could say that we get between four and $10 per unit. But they were so excited about the technology that they prepaid the royalties on all 33,000 wow. units. If you've already been prepaid for the license from the first licensee, why do you need the money today? So we have a burn rate right now of $30,000 a month, and that needs to go up to $50,000 a month in order to bulk up our engineering team and get to market on time. Listen, I see tech moving so quick, and I just don't see the long-term vision because things will constantly change, so I'm out. Okay, understood. Eric, I think it's really clever. This could be one of those things that could be 
world-changing revolutionary technology. All right, I'll give you the 500,000 for 10%. Oh, man. Oh, tell me now. Kevin and I were just talking, so I'll tell you now. This is a tricky space, right? But you're very impressive. Kevin and I are gonna give you an offer together. Okay. So our offer is 500,000. Uh, 9% interest is a loan. We want 15% equity. We're gonna split it 7.5% each. But we'll guide you to the extent you need it on licensing. We do a lot of licensing. You don't need so a there's line of credit. A lot of... You're trying to build a business. We're looking, and we're looking for a partner. We're yeah, looking for I'll give you the 500,000 for 10%. We'll build this thing together. This is not the time to get a loan. Either you believe in this, then you're going to. Oh, uh, we absolutely the... believe in it. Absolutely. We don't need a loan for this. 500,000, 10%. We've changed ours. I think ours. that's a fair offer. We've that's changed my ours. Last we're offer. no longer a line of credit. We're going to be the 500,000. We're going to put the money in as an investment, but we're still at the 15%. You get two sharks, two huge sharks. You guys want 15%? Yeah, because we're we really do. good. Guys, you got two offers. What do you want to do? Because we're going to really work for it. This is a tough decision. Um, it is. Good offers are tough. Good offers are tough. Um, <sighs> I've made you an offer that's fundamentally better. 500,000 for 10%. You want two You've sharks You've gotten it this far. Huh? We can get to Can we get level. the three of you guys for 15%? We'll, we'll do that. We'll, we'll do that deal right now. <laughs> for 500 for 15. 500 for 15 if we get the three of you. Done. 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 Yeah. Cool. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I don't know if we're going to turn our heads like that. <laughs> Thank you, Kevin. You are very good, my Thank friend. You. Yeah. Thank you. Like Congratulations, Thank you. guys. Thanks. Congratulations, guys. It was two really hard choices, and at the end of the day, we turned it into one really great one. One great choice, absolutely.